Rare glimpse into the National Dog Show exposes the unexpected reality. As you glance over at your mutt lounging on your couch after he destroyed your favorite pair of shoes, it may be hard to understand the world of show dogs. These athletic, perfectly trained, and incredibly elegant dogs aren't your typical family pooch. They're in a league of their own. These dogs don't pop up by accident either. When it comes to claiming dog show gold, handlers and owners will do anything to get to the top. And that makes for some backstage moments that would leave the public scratching their heads. Sit, stay, and enjoy these little known behind the scenes facts about dog shows. Number 1. Dog handlers and trainers set up little treadmills made specifically for dogs in order to teach them the perfect stride. The treadmill helps them maintain the right pace that will have them strutting into the winner circle come showtime. Number 2. The stance of each dog is crucial in shows. In the past, trainers would teach the dogs to stand on soup cans at a certain length apart. Now many use wooden blocks or other markers to teach the pups where to stand. 3. There are times when the dogs are forced to be indoors for many hours at a time, unable to go outside and do their business. In these cases, makeshift puppy porta potties, fenced off areas with absorbent material, are set up for the participants. 4. It may surprise you that the winner of Best in Show doesn't win any money. The prize is pride. For those in the dog show world, the idea of being champion is enough. No massive check is necessary. Number 5. The intimidating dog show judges are extremely analytical. They objectively assess every breed from head to toe. But at the end of the day, best in show often has an intangible quality. Judges have cited a certain je ne sais quoi as part of the judging system. Number 6. During showtime, the dogs basically get whatever they want. When the spotlight's on them, simple dog treats won't do. One handler said she provides filet mignon for her dogs during the show. Any dog would transform into a show dog if they were given steak. Number 7. The grooming stations are essential to the backstage of any dog show. Many groomers use weird hacks to keep the puppy's coats fresh, like using dryer sheets or even chalk to maintain smooth fur. Some looks are more extreme than others. Number 8. Many handlers have commented on the unnatural nature of dog shows. The only reason these animals are so sophisticated at trotting in circles under hot light is because of extensive training. Handlers aim to make it fun for the dog, hence the filet mignon. Number 9. Since these dogs are basically celebrities, they never show up inconspicuously. Dog entourages are very much a thing and can consist up to 12 people, each responsible for something different. Groomers, handlers, and owners all play a specific role. It can be exhausting. Number 10. What you don't see on camera are the dogs waiting around under the hot lights for long periods of time. Because the intensity can make dogs overheat, handlers usually have spray bottles of water to keep them cool. Number 11. Benched shows are actually a dream come true for the dog-adoring public. Every dog is required to be at their assigned bench for the entire day, during which the public can buy a ticket to come and interact with the different pups before actual showtime. Number 12. All the dogs participating in the show are trained to be very chill behind the scenes. That's what makes the bench show so successful. These dogs can interact with the public like seasoned politicians. From a young age, they desensitize the dogs to loud noises and distractions. Number 13. If you're watching the dog show from home, you can't hear the hype music that plays for each group, but it's there. Much like athletes before a game, each category of dog gets their own entrance music, from Elvis to Post Malone. Number 14. Handlers can only be handlers if their vehicle passes a rigorous inspection. In case of emergency, they must have a generator, AC, water, and current fire extinguishers. This is so in the event of a disaster, they'd be able to keep their dog safe. Number 15. It may seem obvious, but there is one thing that will get any dog disqualified from participation no matter their star power. If a dog bites another dog or any human, their show days are over. Number 16. The outfits you see handlers wearing are no accident. They make strategic choices, 
never wanting to overshadow the dog they're showing. Practical footwear is essential to maintaining the perfect trot during the show. Number 17. Dog handlers can be superstitious about various routines and accessories. Some handlers use the same leash every year because they see it as lucky, or conversely, they never use the same leash twice because it's bad luck. If plans change without warning, tensions can run high. Number 18. The hobby isn't easy on the handler. Many career dog handlers complain of hip and knee problems due to the grueling schedule and physical demands during show season. Most of them claim it's 100% worth it. Number 19. When it comes to picking your next pooch, bench shows can be an awesome resource. Getting to interact with so many different breeds and experts can help you figure out which dog has the right set of traits to match up with your lifestyle. Number 20. The AKC recognizes 193 dog breeds, the most recent being the Azawak in 2019. At the end of the day, it doesn't matter if you have a show dog or a rescue dog, you want to give them the best care. Sometimes as dog owners, we make mistakes. Animal lover? Subscribe to our channel for all the latest in pet care and animal rescue. You can also visit our store where you'll find cheeky merch for cats and dog lovers, including fun and original t-shirt designs and many other accessories you will love. Our earnings will help support and rescue animals in need and make a difference in their welfare. For more information, visit www.pawsfashion.store. Thank you for being a part of our growing community and for caring about animals in their lives especially at a time where they need you the most.